I'm here at Havelock Primary School today visiting the new additionally resourced provision for pupils with special educational needs and disabilities. Havelock Primary Arc opened in the autumn and provides specialist teaching in a mainstream school. Small classes of children with autistic spectrum disorder, speech language and communication needs come together every school day in these brand new specially designed classrooms. And our brilliant teachers and specialist staff work closely with children and parents and the rest of the school community to create an inclusive culture that supports all of our children to do their very best. With um, the whole school approach, all of the children in the whole school are learning like a sign language. So we have a good morning, everybody knows how to say that. Uh, we have silent clapping in assembly so that we don't frighten the children because they're sitting amongst 350 of the uh, mainstream pupils. We want them to feel really safe and comfortable in all of that. And they felt so safe that they were able to present uh, in an assembly in, in front of everybody. We have big ambitions in Ealing and by the end of primary school many more Ealing students with special educational needs have achieved the expected standard in maths and English than in the rest of the country. We also place a big emphasis on developing the skills and independence they need to succeed. And wherever possible, we want our SEN students to grow into happy, confident and independent adults with the skills they need to earn their own money and make their own choices. Through the Ealing Learning Partnership, we continue to protect our local schools from becoming academies and ensuring that our schools are properly run to provide good quality education for all students. At Ealing Council, we've kept our promise to create 62 new school places for children with special educational needs, but we aren't finished yet. We know that more are needed and we are working hard to create new classrooms to meet the needs that we know are there. For many, that journey starts in places like Havelock Primary School, 